How's it going everyone? Today we're going to take a look at uh, Bitcoin and uh, I don't know, come to a conclusion after what uh, happened uh, yesterday. So believe it or not, this was drawn back in January, February to target some, some buying points because a friend uh, reached out to me and asked me should I buy Bitcoin and at that time I was expecting the price of Bitcoin to to retreat in this area and of course it didn't and it shut up and then I said hmm come on like there has to be a correction at some point I, I have this line drawn, it's just an imaginary line, I, it, it really has no basis, to be honest. It was, it's just an imaginary line, but <laughs> it came right to it. Anyway, um, like one month ago, I made a video when Bitcoin was in this area. And it had uh, it dropped to 42k, and yeah, at the time it it seemed like that was the correction, and uh, Bitcoin was was meant to go straight up. Of course, it didn't, and it surprised everyone yesterday, and starting like two or three days ago. Actually, one week ago almost when it started dropping but yesterday there was blood on the streets and we should know that when there's blood on the streets you should be greedy and buy and I did buy but not at the bottom obviously <laughs> it's very hard to time the bottom actually if we go to the 15 minute chart like it dropped in 25 minutes something like that 45 minutes from give it or give or take 40k to 30k and then it shot right back up so I was able to scoop some coins when Bitcoin was at 35k so in my opinion you should be greedy when others are fearful actually it's not my opinion it's someone smarter than me said it I don't know who but it's an old saying and I try to live by it so now obviously there is some risk but I'm I, I took that risk, not with Bitcoin, but with uh, Chainlink, for example. Link is a really, really nice project. It, it tends to only go up. Obviously, it has bubbles. But after a drop like this, to the 200, uh, this is the 300. Let's go to the 200 week mo moving average. Whenever it drops to the 200 week moving average, you should buy. I mean, you should not listen to me, but I am buying here. So I hope this was helpful to you. I will be coming with more updates in the near future. So thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe to my channel. See you guys later.